Hey everybody, welcome back to Ready Steady Play. We're still here in Killforth, mm -hmm. fending off the gloom. Right, it's my turn to go first, because I'm the first hero. So, let's find out what I'm going to do. One, two, three, how many? Seven? Five? Yep, seven. Six? Seven. Have some black hearts. I'm seven, two. One, As a vampire, two, three, I approve four, of these black five, hearts. Six, seven. Not red for blood? Not red for blood. So, oh yeah, here's another fucking rule we forgot about. So when your max hit points goes up, when you regale a chapter, uh, you get a hit point back. Oh, yeah. So that if you're on full, you don't then need another hit point. Um, we've not been playing that rule because we didn't know about it. There's a huge amount of rules. Foolish. There is. Book. It took it's like a novel. <laughs> it's 30 pages, and to be honest, they're all kind of necessary. It's true. But we'll talk about that later. <laughs> For now, I'm going to fucking regale people, because I'm about to move on to the final chapter of my shit. Wow. It's been trying out five pages. I got my place here. It's my secret pool. I got my demon here. That's the gargoyle. <laughs> cool. So, let's find out what happens. Oh, I'm going to go up to uh, eight hit points. I'm going to get another hit point. Yeah. And uh, we're going to find out what happens in Escort Being, Chapter 4. The being explains that it has wandered the lands for centuries, looking to return home while the Ancients' minions sought to hunt it down and destroy it, just as they attempted to thwart your efforts to help it. It's a long sentence. That is a long sentence. Breathe. Thankful for your aid, the noble being leads you to a clearing where the flowers bloom and the air shimmers. The being acknowledges your assistance, but insists on one final test to prove you are worthy of the reward he intends for you. You must step beyond the veil. Ooh. So here we go, Veil Walk. Okay, great. So uh, here we go, there's the ancient being, or the, not the ancient being, the, the being. It being. looks kind of like an alien. It's influence level 7. And uh, I have to go to the Verdant Fields, which is miles away. Ugh. And achieve a level 7 influence, which should be fine because my influence is 6. He looks a bit moody. <laughs> yeah, he certainly doesn't look like grateful. No. Be more grateful! <laughs> It's like, ugh, I've seen your efforts so far this game. It displeases me. <laughs> I'm also going to get my level 4 ability, which is my final ability. So let's find out. These better be good. These better be good. Okay, we've got Crusader, which is a veil deed. Defeat a demon at your location. Or High Priest. You may use influence for a fight test during a battle. Hmm. hmm. <laughs> eh. <laughs> Not that one. <laughs> well, so... I mean, that's kind of... I kind of don't want the demon one, right? Because no. if I take... I mean, this is kind of silly. Because if I take the demon one... I mean, it's obvious I should take the pious one, right? But if I take the pious one, it just means that in a demon, it doesn't matter whether I use my influence or my fight. So they both kind of make my early, earlier Templar ability redundant. Yeah. Agreed. I'm sad now. But I think I do have to take a high priest and then just focus on influence. Hey, do you think I can use the uh, the dwarven axe to defeat the evasive <laughs> penance? Yeah. <laughs> so zero sacrifice this to defeat an enemy at your location. Unfortunately, as we know from card games, this is referring specifically to keywords, and the evasive penance is not uh, an enemy. She is, in fact. There is no enemy written here. Well, that's what I mean. No, here I meant the evasive penance. Oh. Just like when I fight her, just be like. Uh, Dwarven Axe, you're dead! <laughs> and get out of here! But actually, she's an ancient, not an enemy, so yeah. I can't do that. So I'm going to take High Priestess, which allows me to use my influence instead of my fight in a fight. So uh, That's good. You know, diplomacy is the... Because uh, you've got, like, six rather than three. Four, even. Yep, yeah, so uh, I do have six instead of four, so that's quite good. Even if I lose my swashbuckler, mm -hmm. I've still got, you know... Five instead of three. Yeah, and uh, the thing is, the uh, the Templar is still reasonably good because it puts my uh, currently puts my uh, oh no, it puts see, and then it makes this fucking uh, what? Wait a minute, where's my thing? That thing. Yeah, it makes that useless, man. Pay one gold to gain plus one fight until the end of the phase. 
I mean, it makes that basically useless. What was the other thing I gave up on? No, but you just use that instead of your five. That's fine. Yeah, right, but I should have taken Journeyman at level two. Instead oh, yeah. of, uh, instead of, uh, well, that's healer, actually. What was my other level three one? Right, so the plus one influence for each ally you have. I should have taken that, because now I've got this ability, local hero, that lets me put money into my fight stat, which now I'm not even going to be using during a battle. No, fuck it, I'll take Crusader. This is making me mad. <laughs> because, I mean, my fight stat is still... Reason <sighs> it's still okay. She's a demon, so I mean, I'm still going <laughs> to... So, I mean, Templar is still going to make make it just as good. The fight value just as good. Yeah, really. yeah. Oh, it's frustrating, though. I should have looked at these beforehand, but we kind of wanted to keep it's the surprise. surprise. But uh, actually, it's just kind of made us dumb at planning. Yeah. Oh, well. It's a good job we don't have that. It's a good job we're not doing, like, a YouTube channel about board games or something. Yeah, that because that would just be stupid otherwise. <laughs> Fools. Who wants to watch these idiots play a board game? I wouldn't. <laughs> That's you. <laughs> That's you. Uh, so, I'm gonna move. Yep. That's one. Great, good, that was riveting. <laughs> I'm also gonna move. You don't have to deal with him though, do you? I don't have to, but I might, because my influence is great. Do you want to deal with him? Well, I can't yet. Oh, because. I need to confront him. Okay. So, my next go is remove the. Um, Obstacle. Obstacle. Great. You get a loot. Hopefully it's better um, than, than nothing. nothing you got before. It wasn't nothing. It was a wooden token. I mean, a cardboard token. That's true. I get two gold. Two gold. Great. Great. I have all this gold. Good for you. Uh, so I'll spend uh, an action point to have a chat to the uh, Rosen Crusader here. So he's got... Looks like the mountain. Influence three. I've got influence six. So I just need three successes to uh, make friends with this man. I'm sure it will be fine. I'm sure it will be fine. Uh, I got two. Do you want to... Um, fate it? Fate it. I mean, I feel like it's getting to the point where I should, but I probably want to save my fate for the Veil Walk, so I'm not going to. But you have still got all four. Yeah, but I might do the Veil Walk today. Okay. I don't know. I mean, probably not now. I'm probably going to run out of shit, but... So now he becomes a... So now I've just got two on there. I just need more. Okay. I just need one more. Do I... So it's back to you. Uh, how come he doesn't turn into an enemy? Because you've got I at least succeeded. one. Yeah, i got at least one. Okay. See, I'm paying attention. <laughs> you would have turned into an enemy if I'd got nothing. Uh, I know. Like you. I know. Right. I'm going to use my... Uh, I'm going to... Can like interact with the interceptoid god shrine. Okay, well you lose a hit point. And you do. Do I? Yeah, map. I thought mm -hmm. it was just the uh, map trap. Trap is uh, trap is only the active player, I think. Oh, is it? Okay. I think so. Yeah, I think it's if it didn't say trap, then it would be all of us. Okay. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> Listen, Mister Tristan Hall, who did literally everything Thing. for this game. If I'm wrong. Tweet at me, bro. At ready, RSP, RSP Network. network. Yeah. Uh, this is triggered and resolved immediately when it is engaged in battle, but for the first stage, uh, but before the first stage of engagement. A trap specifies a cost that must be paid by the active hero. Yeah. Okay. And I think map just means anywhere on the map. Well, yeah. Uh, one. One. Uh, what are, are you doing? Study. Yes. Yeah. It's going to be a long haul. Yeah. You should have hidden first, man. It doesn't help me. Yeah, that would give you an extra dice. I thought I could only do that with... No, hidden gives you plus one to any test. Oh, of course it does. <laughs> what game have you been playing for five hours, man? <laughs> I'm going oh. to keep romancing the Rosen Crusader. Okay. <laughs> Look into my eyes. I am a sexy vampire. Not like the lovely not, red eyes you have. I'm the uh, lovely what? red teeth. <laughs> I want to be the guy from uh, from uh, Interview with a Vampire, not a Twilight vampire. Yeah. What's his name? The uh, interview guy. Tom Cruise. 
guy. Yeah, no, what's his the character? Oh, Brad Pitt. Um, oh, it's something French, isn't it? Yeah. Lefort or something like that. Yeah, Lefort. Louis. Something like that. Yeah. It'll come to us probably. Uh, wow, one success. Fortunately, that's all I needed. Man, dice chucking. Not chucking six dice, getting nothing. Nothing. So I get None. two gold, if you will, sir. Two gold for you. And I can either keep this stranger noble card, or I can have a um, an ally card, which I will take the ally card. Okay. Oh, cool. I guess. Right. Back to you. Back to me. I'm going to give it another go. I have four dice, please. Two successes. Two. So that goes to three. I wanted to make a joke, but you didn't fail. My nah. joke only works if you fail. Good. <laughs> so, good job, I guess. Yes. Thanks. <laughs> uh, I will just continue to go. Ah, oh, damn it. I'm not hidden. Because I was confronting a stranger. I will... Hide. Yeah, because I've got to go through the barren wastes. Okay. I don't want to be jumped by something awful. Yeah. Without being hidden. Hopefully... This will get me over the line. Four dice, please. Here we go, sir. Thank you. Nothing! Oh. <sighs> you bounced. Bounce. Boing, boing. That's what Chris says. Bounced. <sighs> so dumb. <laughs> Which totally now ruins me. Why? Because what I wanted to do was... That would be... That would be, like, get me across here, I would hide, use one of them to hide and one of them to move, so then if I encountered anything mean when I went into the forest, I would be hidden. Right. Well, you can't Otherwise, do that now. Health. Yeah. yeah, you're going to have to stay in the gloomy area. Yep. Getting gloomed up. Getting gloomed up. Cool. I'm going to go here into the barren wastes. Dice game. <laughs> Should have studied harder. It Should have done. Should have done. Okay, it's a stranger. It's okay. a hermit. His weakness is arcane. He is also surprisingly difficult, given that he doesn't have any gold or anything. I mean, I don't know, man. Like, some of these things. It's pretty hard. Anyway, he's a stranger. I don't have to encounter him. Yeah. I also don't have any arcane keywords here, so... Yeah. I might just move on. I would. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Again, four dice, please. <laughs> <laughs> don't bounce nope you've done it mine <laughs> so I'm gonna take three gold and put this place in my hand all good all good for you <laughs> damn right um well, I'm like, oh, open hot heat. That's a, mm. that's a gloom area. I might go in there and take a damage. But uh, actually, I remembered, um, for example, that uh, the Abyss Appendix is going to get bonuses for every quest on the board. So someone needs to do this fucking quest. So I'm going to move in here. I need a quest. Well, too bad, because I'm doing this one. You're going to have to go and get that one. Uh. Well, I might just beat you up there and get it first. No! Yeah. <laughs> because it's got... Uh, I can do it for free. I can literally move in there, do that, and move out. Well, keep that one for me then. <laughs> You've got miles to go. Uh, Too far away. It's your turn. Uh, okay, I'm gonna move. It's <laughs> my go. Now, because I've moved into the forest, can I veil or can I only veil? Yeah, deeds are any time. Right. So I think. <laughs> correct me in the wrong. Uh, if I'm wrong, please correct me in the comments below. Right. Give me a wood. Card. <laughs> what is a wood card? Uh, you mean a forest? Yeah. I'm in the wood. I was like, what are we playing? Zelda's of Catan here? <laughs> uh, isolated pedestal. It's a place. Oh, God. I've just worked hours to try and get a place. I don't need it. Yeah, fine. So I make camp. Cool. Uh, I'll make camp too. Cool. So first we check for gloom locations. Oh no, I'm in gloom. <laughs> um, 
And then, and then we reveal a night card. Place, spawning pit. Place this at the Lava Canyon. When night begins, each hero at this location loses one HP. Lava Canyon. Oh god, that place that is That place is the worst. Down. <laughs> Don't go anywhere near that. Yeah, so now the Lava Canyon's in gloom. There's an invincible raging vampire and a spawning pit. Place spawning demons. The worst. <laughs> and uh, it's also got obstacle. It's just the worst place. Don't go there. The Lava Canyon is so bad. <laughs> I would definitely not go anywhere near. I don't know, I heard the lava canyon was pretty hot <laughs> right now. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so that's a uh, resolve the night card. So <laughs> anyone hidden becomes unhidden. I was uh, trying to think of a way to retort for you, but I couldn't. I failed. <laughs> we can reset our uh, veiled cards. Okay. And uh, then we get some action points. I get six and you get seven, I think. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. For you, buddy. Actually, no, I get seven because I've got uh, more hit points than you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so. I am first hero, so I remain the first hero. hero. Go mm. on, first hero. Do your worst. I'm going to become hidden. Guess what? <laughs> what? I'm becoming hidden too. After all those guys. <laughs> yes. Good for you. I guess what I'm going to do. Mm, you're going to get the quest? <laughs> I'm going to move up to the dead swamp. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, dude. <laughs> Ninja your shit. <laughs> uh, but first, oh, look, it's another quest. It is Escort Traveler. His retinue was slaughtered. You must return him safely home to collect your reward. Okay. Mm, meh. Back to you. More quests. <laughs> uh, why don't you go through the lava canyon? <laughs> I'll just go straight on. <laughs> just go through the lava canyon, man. <laughs> I will move to the plains. It's a stranger, farmer, he's wearing glasses, mm. and it says, Farmer Samwise, Ganji, <laughs> unknown. Farmer Samwise had for more, far more to contend with outside the sprawl than just weather, crops, and cattle. He also had to contend with idiot assassins <laughs> stumbling through his plains. Um, great. And his weakness is martial, but you don't have any martial stuff. No, you are not a martial. I'm a shadow martial person. Oh, I have a martial guy. I have a swashbuckler. Oh. So I could just go in there and deal with that, but I'm not going to. Yeah. Instead, I'm going to spend an action to just go up to Spire Tor and resolve find a cure as a deed. Mm -hmm. Boom! Nailed it. One gold. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I get a free gold. Get a spell. You didn't pack up your tent. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I didn't pack up my tent. <laughs> I'm not sure how I feel about this spell. No? Hmm. Is everyone at home, like, super mad at me for, like, wandering off when my quest was down there and just doing other shit, like, preventing Michael from winning? Yes! <laughs> well, we're just out of time for today, so we're going to come back tomorrow to find out if Michael's going to be able to get these quests before I ninja them all from him. Mm -hmm. And uh, in the meantime, if you're enjoying the series, throw a like on the video and uh, leave a comment to let me know if you're mad that I didn't go do Veil Walk and instead wandered off to ninja his shit. <laughs> I would be. See you all tomorrow, everyone. See you guys.